Good afternoon, America. And today we are having our 2016 presidential debate with our six presidential candidates. Our first candidate is Mr. Boris. How are you today? Oh, I'm pretty good, man. How are you? That's great. I'm good myself, too. I'm good myself. Our second candidate is Governor George from California. How are you, sir? Good. All right, great. Our third candidate is Senator... Senator... Senator IDs. IDs... IDs? I'm sorry, can you say your name? Senator Ibanez from New York. Oh, New York. Cool. Uh, now we have our fourth candidate, uh, Governor Doofy Smirch. I'm sorry, can you say your name? Bill from Schmertz. Oh, great. From Colorado. From Colorado. And our fifth one is Governor Cash from the state of Illinois. And our sixth one is Sen Senior. What? I'm sorry. Do you guys know him? Nope. Nope. Uh, hola. My name is Senor Jesus. I am supportive of whoever you guys say, and I'll tell you who I support. Just go. Go on. Don't worry about me. Go. Right. Your debate. Okay, so okay. rules apply for this presidential debate. Each candidate will have 30 seconds to start the opening statement. Each candidate will have 60 seconds to answer a question, and every candidate is able to interrupt that candidate who's answering the question and say their opinion no matter what. Uh, closing statements are up to 30 seconds. Uh, if you move from your post, you will be you will be punished in a harsh way. Now we will be starting with well, Mr. Boris. Uh, it's classified. We will be starting with Mr. Boris. Oh, okay. Opening statement. You have 30 seconds. Hola, mama. Uh, pretty much what I'm trying to do here is uh, run for president because I'm already famous and like everybody knows me. So, uh, yeah, you know, it's like, why not just go for it? Go, 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 nine yards. All right, Mr. Boris, what is <clears throat> opening statement? A little short, and we're going to move on to Governor Joy from California. You have 30 seconds to present your opening statement. I think everybody should vote for me because I like to party in California. Best vote for me, best mm -hmm. president, 2016. All right, that's a good opening statement, I I guess. Uh, now we have our third candidate, Senator Idenez from New York. You now have 30 seconds to present your opening statement starting now. Hey yo, what's up? I'm Senator Ibanez from New York, the big fucking apple. You already know. You already know what goes on over there. It's fucking crazy. We got savages. You vote for me. I'll make sure we destroy the fucking terrorists. All those bullshit motherfuckers that did shit way back in the day. We're gonna fucking destroy the asses. I also promise every motherfucker in America gets free money and a lot of bitches and a brick of weed. All right, so vote for me and you get everything you fucking want. Capiche? Capiche. Now we have our fourth candidate, Governor Doofenshmirtz from Colorado. You now have 30 seconds to present your opening statement, starting now. Terrorists are bad, guns are good, uh, weed's gonna be illegal everywhere, vote for me. 420. <laughs> Alright, that concludes your 30 seconds, I guess. Uh, number five, Governor Cass from Illinois. You now have 30 seconds to present your opening statement. Yeah, that's a big one. Here you go. Alright, your 30 seconds are now up. Uh, senior, senior, whatever your name is, if you're even running for president, what is your 30 second statement? Hola mamá, uh, hey, hola, tío Jose, uh, como estas, uh, tía Jenny, I hope you, I hope you made tacos by the time I get home, uh, hey, I'm not running for president, I just want to say hi, um, oh, I'm done. Well, um, sorry, um, you want yeah. autograph? Alright, we will now begin with questions no, going in the you. same order we, we did opening statements, now Mr. Boris, what is your opinion wait, wait, on wait, guns? Wait, 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 Hey, callate, callate. Okay, I'm sorry. sorry. Alright, what is your opinion oh, on guns, Mr. Boris? You know, I had a real emotional bond <clears throat> with my AK in the uh, Amazon rainforest in Argentina. I, I, I really think guns should just be everywhere in America. I agree. I, I love you, Mr. Boris. All right. Second you. question will go to Governor Joy since there was no disagreeing on his gun statement. I, I have a, I have um, a I'm sorry, Mr. Mr. Governor, Cass, Governor no, Cass. Governor no, Cass, if, no, if you do no. not calm uh, yourself down, Governor Cass, if you don't calm shut yourself down. <laughs> I'll fucking kill you in your sleep. Governor Cass, I will call yeah, security. Nice. Shut your mouth, no. Governor Cass. Yeah, hi. I thought All right. Right. Governor Joy. Not a, not a debate between gangsters? Okay. Governor Joy. Your question is, how, I'm sorry, I read that wrong. What is your opinion on communism and what will you do to provoke it? 
communism. I think communism, communism is awesome. We mean equal money to everybody. Mm. I think that's awesome. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Governor yeah. Cast, if you don't... This is your booger now. Governor Cast, if I wound you one more time, you will be disqualified from the campaign. Okay. Alright, um, I'm sorry, I didn't even understand what he was saying, but we will move on to Senator Idenez from New York. Senator Idenez, what is your opinion on weed? I'm not looking. Now weed, you come to New York, you're going to get the most fire weed you ever smoke, alright? Weed is a gateway drug to a lot of good things. You can do acid off of weed, you can do <clears throat> molly, you can do shrooms, DMT, <clears throat> MXC, you can do whatever the fuck you want. Weed, if you vote with me, everyone gets a free brick of weed in the fucking mailbox the next day and that's a fact all right that concludes your 30 seconds and um governor governor do for from colorado what will you do to the american people's taxes if you do become president i will most definitely lower them damn taxes for sure because because definitely there those high taxes is just a low person standards those are so bad people put taxes on things because they're too lazy to work so they just make shit more expensive all right um you, senor. I governor it. governor cast caete puto puto caete all right oh. governor cast from illinois huh. as you may understand yeah, as you may understand, you are pretty rude, but here's your 30 second opening statement oh, starting yeah. now. Okay, so I am a good man and I will do anything you want. Okay, there's your 30 seconds. I'm sorry, I should not give that to you. Alright, we're moving on to senior, whatever his name is. As you may understand, we have a lot of Mexicans crossing the border into the United States. What do you plan to do if you become president to stop that? I, I would uh I would ask them what their password or what their background is, you know. I wouldn't just <clears> send them back because some people come to America for the good shit, <clears> like smoking weed in Colorado, you know. Like that guy, New York guy over there, I, I, I appreciate him because he, he wants what I want. And he got my vote, I'll tell you that much, if he, uh, I don't get too far, you know. Yeah. Okay, all right. Now this question is open up to the entire, all the six candidates. So this question mm -hmm. is... What will you do to destroy ISIS? Nuke them. Nuke, nuke them? Yes, wow, nuke them. Pretty, uh, pretty straightforward. Get 3,000 nukes, drop them all at Governor once. Governor Cass, you're talking too much. Of their day. Governor Cass, oh boy. Got Tag. I, would, I would bomb the shit out of all of them. Get all of them. Right. Yes. Now hold up. Now what none of these motherfuckers have been saying is what they've been saying what they wanna do, but what I'm gonna do if I become president, I'm gonna get all my motherfuckers from New York. All my motherfuckers from New York. All my people that I grew up with, we all gonna go with fucking baseball bats and we're gonna bash their fucking skulls in. I'm gonna take a dump all over their territories. And mark it as my own. Then yeah. they will understand my dominance over them, and we will smoke weed and execute them Wait, one by one. Sir, 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 how how would you get enough poop to do that? I it's take enough of heat. I take but, enough bullshit every day. It comes right back out. I'll bake a Then damn terrorists never get enough. <clears throat> Okay, we will be moving on to our next question. Um, so, I'm I was thinking about getting um, some new some new clothes, and what do you think is the best place for me to get the new clothes? The Gap. My personal line of uh, clothing that I uh, Flea market. established six years ago. Oh, I got some hand-me-downs that you might discount. fit in, Will. <laughs> Hold up, hold up, hold up, whoa, 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 whoa. Now look at how I'm dressed. I got swag, bro. I got fucking swag. You go to you Gucci, no things, my right? like my, you go to Louis Vuitton, you get yourself some nice ass clothes, you're gonna get bitches on your dick, bro, all day. Okay, I just wanna say, yeah, sir, yeah, this is a presidential election. Best thing is I think the Salvation Army, they, they have cheap clothes, and I got, my, I got 
I got my stuff. Uh, I had to rent my suit, and I'm basically in debt now because of it. So I would say Salvation Army because it's cheaper. You won't work for me for three dollars in a day. No, go fuck My suit is made out of yarn. I'll pay you a penny. My grandma hated this one. Okay, so we will now be moving on to the next question. Candidates, candidates, if you will please let me ask the next question. Candidates, please. All right, so this is what I wear every day. I found this in the back dumpster. a magician. It's great. Candidates, I will be I'll be asking the next question now. So I'm pretty sure in Chicago we understand there is a lot of killing and a lot of disorder. So what do you guys plan to do to solve the problem of murder in Chicago? Now hold on, yeah, hold on. Military, military personnel everywhere. Two dollars each man. Who so has a gun, um, I will give Mr. Doofenshmirtz, are you referring to martial law? Uh, uh yes, that is affirmative. Does anybody have any disagrees? In high and area. Because of uh, crime, there will be mar it will be marked as a uh, martial law. We'll have to send in the division. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I agree. I fucking agree with what Doofenshmirtz said. We gotta send in Doofenshmirtz. motherfuckers with big ass guns. Doofenshmirtz. Yeah, yeah, right yeah what he said. We didn't send in the division to free my friend Biggie. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, so we will now be moving on to our right, next right. question, everyone. Uh, no, wait, our wait, next can question. Real quick about the last uh, question. Yeah, go ahead. You have 15 seconds. I just wanted to say that I am one of the people who get the killing a lot, you know, because fuck everybody. Like, uh, you know, like these guys on the side shit, so, you know, I shoot them. Can I yeah. have permission to throw a boom potato at his feet? No, no boom potato. Uh, uh, I'll, I'll make sure not to kill your family. Uh, can we, yeah, I'll just make sure not to kill your family because, you know, if I die, you die. All right, so yes, we're moving on. We're moving on to our next question, everyone. So, what do you, what will you guys do as president to improve education in America? Some model of the school, because it seems like everyone in America is a retard. Like that Doofenshmirtz guy right there. He seems like he he called a grenade a boom -tater. and you know it's kind of <laughs> stupid. Why the fuck would you call a boom a grenade a boom -tater? You know, I'm I think pretty it's pretty stupid that you're a full-grown man and you went into debt for after renting a suit. Oh. It's American. It's American system, you know. I I, I make no money. Get it's, under uh, it. It's bullshit. I'm I'll under it. Look at me. Business. I told you before. I will hire you for two pennies an hour. Ain't nobody gonna hire your stinky ass shut over there. How much they paying hey. you? I'll pay you half of what they're paying you. You know, it's kind of sad yeah. that my suit costs more than his six months rent. <laughs> exactly. This suit. That's it's kind of bullshit. I, I feel like that has more need a, uh, sentimental value <laughs> than as much money as this you can make in two years. More than your toothpaste. Now, right, can, can, whoa, we, can whoa, we move on to the next whoa. question, please? Hold uh, really the fuck about... up, yo. Hold the fuck up. This question was about education. Yeah, all right. Say. Now, New York, we're all fucking stupid from drinking lean all day. So what I will do is I'll give everyone a free education. Now, clearly. Governor fucking Cass don't got no damn education because he's trying to make money by hiring for half pay. Who the fuck are you, stupid fucking bitch? I am the fucking, fucking teacher. Of Illinois, sir. I will okay, do whatever bitch. I please. I'm that the is, state that... senator. I'll fuck you up. He that gets his money right. from goddamn Monopoly. I know board the secretary of the defense personally. After this debate, man. I will kill you after this All right. debate. Don't worry, All right. New Yorkers. Candidates, dude, candidates, you. please. You got my vote. Candidates, please. Go now, bro. Candidates, please. We're moving on to our next question. You. What would you guys uh, do? Kill your Candidate, hey, Governor Cast, if I vote you one more time, I swear to God. Rock on, you know. I you swear to God, fuck. Governor Cast. You need to understand that we are under a death trap. <laughs> Got it. Governor, all right. So we are now moving on, moving to our next question. What's this? What, what, what would right what would you what would you presidential candidates do to improve national security so the American people can feel safe and sound? Put the gangsters Put the at the border. on all borders. Put the gangsters at the borders. Canine Put the units everywhere. Spend a National lot Guard, of fucking martial money law on the fucking military. Spec ops. Now we drive Navy around seals. in, in ragtag fucking jeeps all day. You spend 18 quadrillion fucking dollars on that bullshit, and no terrorist ISIS motherfucker is gonna fuck with us. I, I say put Wonderful the gangsters out there. You know, I feel like if you put the gangsters out there, they'll they'll do some stuff. You know what I mean? Like. Think about it, they shoot innocent people, 
if, if I, I'm one of those, I'm one of the people that shoot innocent people, so I feel like that if I Can have people to shoot that, that would, that would kill me. No, I'm giving you good information, man. I'm yeah. inside, but I might die after this anyway, so you know. But yeah, yeah send up what you want. All right, so we we move on to our next question. So um, there's this there's this so hooker on yeah, Strawberry yeah. Avenue, and uh, I was eyeballing her the other day. So what do you, what do you hey, guys I think? I her the other day, man. Oh, how how I is she? Her the whatever her name she was, is. She was good. Has anybody else seen her? Yeah, mom. No, 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 man. Expensive. She was expansive. You know what I mean? Like, bro, it was like, bro, it was like this one hooker though. She was really good. Her name was Cheesecake. Amigo, we gotta go get Cheesecake, and if we're gonna go at this, we'll get her. Okay. Amigo, we gotta go get Cheesecake, and if we're gonna go at this, we'll get her. Okay. All right, yeah, yeah, man. Got you. See, I came to this place with the band. I'm making friends. I feel good about myself. All right, so we are. We we now be moving to um more direct <coughs> questions to each other so uh mr borsch what is your opinion on uh governor george from new york uh which one is that again the one to your immediate right. right next to you oh the one the one with the mask suit oh uh uh you know i even though we have our differences it ain't all that bad i kind of feel like i have the same views but you know, yeah. I, I'm famous and he's not. I feel Who's me. fucking phone is that? Shut up. That's that's cheesecake. Sorry, All right. that was my grandma. We will, will be use, we will be moving on to our next part and um alright. Governor George, what is your opinion on Senator Ivanez? Uh who is that guy again? The one to your immediate right. This guy right here with the snake outfit. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> snake I, I agree with him. I think he's cool. I hope he gets picked. Yeah, you better fucking cheese. agree. I hope he picks me as vice per vice president. Muchacho, so it's Senate um, Governor Governor Jordan. Are you saying that you are going to lose the candidacy? Yes. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Yeah. I will right, moving on to somebody who top, might who might top actually top win. Governor top Governor Cass from the state of Illinois. What's your opinion on Senior Hernandez? I think he's name is Jesus, you fucking prick. Oh. Everybody say cheese. Alright, um we'll moving on to bitch. our next one. Uh Senator Idenez, what is your opinion you, on sir. Governor Governor Doofenshmirtz? Hey yo, he's cool people. He smokes weed, I smoke weed. He's cool, that's it. That's All right. right. That is that sounds like a great partnership right there. All right, so this is our this is everyone's final opportunity to talk to any other candidate or respond to any other candidate right now. You guys have 45 seconds. I agree with everybody except for Doofenshmirtz and uh, Mr. Senor Cash right here because Senor Cash is a prick and Doofenshmirtz is uh, I haven't really heard much of his ideas and yeah that's it. I'm done. I think you're a low class citizen. Stupid party. You want to kill this motherfucker? Right after that. Hey, I'll make you a deal. If all five of you vote for me, I'm going to put you in my next movie. Oh, I need the money. Can I be in your, your movie? Your movies are terrible. They got a two rating on Grubhub, and that's not even for movies. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, Senor Jesus. Whatever he say he's going to give you, whatever he say he's going to give you, I'll give you double. Mm. I'll triple it. Mr. Wary, I have a question for you. Uh, yes, Governor Cast. What do you think? Who will you vote for? Who do you agree with the most? Uh, what I the would... fuck are you pointing at? Who the Everyone. fuck are you pointing at? over there and you shit. No respect and shit. You got no fucking respect for pointing at people in their fucking face. I ought to go over there with a fucking brick and knock your fucking teeth in. Do it, bitch. <laughs> Well, yeah, according to Senor according Lee to this Lee presidential Lee debate, Lee I state my opinion on the most qualified for president will be narrowed down to Mr. Borsch, Senator Idenez, and Governor Doofenshmirtz. What? Okay. Those are the three candidates I would give my vote to. But we are now moving on to closing statements. Uh, I guess Sen Governor Doofenshmirtz is one. Oh, okay. Go back. Uh, closing Sorry statements. About that. The sun was in my eyes. I needed you, to take everyone a has. To just walk. Everyone has 30 seconds to present their closing statement, starting with Mr. Boris. I believe it's all with a man. He does. Uh, what you want to do is go for me, because pretty much, uh, 
everybody's gonna get red volts back and beetle and uh our president no i'm just kidding that car sucks talk right. about that black black folks yeah. looking beetle if you know what i mean that uh what's your name Ibanez? yeah the yeah. black the black one that's the that's the one oh, yeah. <laughs> that shit. All right. Um, the black Volkswagen Beetle is the best Volkswagen no, Beetle. That concludes that, <laughs> that concludes Mr. Boris's thirty seconds. <laughs> uh, Governor Joyd, what is your closing statement? You have thirty seconds. Well, for me, I'll throw the biggest party at the White House. Invite everybody. Give you guys free stuff. You are fuck things up. Let's yes, go. Yes, Senor Jesus, peace. I enjoy you, man. All right, go. All right, All right. Uh, that concludes the 30 seconds. Senator Arnez from New York, what is your 30 second closing statement starting now? Hey, yo, again, I'm Senator Ibanez from New York. You can follow me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, MySpace, all that shit. You vote for me. I'll make sure you get weed, bitches, and money. I'm going to fuck up the terrorists, fix the education system. And anyone who starts shit with you, they start shit with me. I'm going to personally come to your house and fucking kick their ass if they're around there fucking with you. I'm going to have my grandma come with a fucking crowbar and stick it up their fucking asshole. You understand me? <laughs> All right, Senator so Arnaz, that, clip, that concludes your 30 seconds. Uh, moving on to Governor Doofenshmirtz from Colorado. What is your 30 second closing statement? Starting now. I'm going to shove my boom potatoes up their asses for the terrorists, down their throats, in their ear holes, clog their noses with them boom potatoes, and then I'm going to lower taxes and make weed legal everywhere because, you know, peace. That, that's what we need. We need peace in this country, low taxes, none of that democratic bullshit. I'm sorry, you might have to bleep that out on national television. <laughs> All right. Uh, Governor Cash from Illinois, what is your 30 second closing statement? If you vote for me, I will kill this bitch. And then I will kill myself. Um, Sounds good. That's great. Uh, senior, <laughs> senior Jose, what is your 30 second closing statement? I, I, it's a Jesus, and I would personally take the sacrifice of. Getting killed by a cast over here if he dies, because I'm pretty sure America will be great again if he kills himself. And I, I vote for, I vote for Mr. Uh, what's it called, Ibanez over there. He's a good candidate. Uh, yeah, I'm done. All right. Well, thank you all for staying with this, us for this presidential this candidate he, the um, debate. And you kill him right now. This is Worry JT, your host and ho and candidates, signing off.